last class we practiced uh, one person doing the mediation. Today, we, everybody needs to get a chance of being the mediator. So the other two people who didn't be the mediator yet will be the mediator today. We'll do some 15 minutes and 15 minutes. Okay, but first, uh, can the mediator, who was the mediator here? What was the result of your mediation? Both of the people agree. And then here, what did the mediator decide? The solution? Decide? If Christine gets married, the mother's in the class gave the heart to the heart. Only if she gets married, give her the jewelry. Did Christine agree? something they did well. Positive things about what they did well. 
But we can't just say positive things either. We have to tell them what they can prove. So that helps them. Okay? So then uh, we're going to do... So just give yourself a number. Give yourself a number. So mediator is number one, the last time. And then the other two people give yourself a number, right? So the last time doing the mediator is number one. Okay, then who, who are, what number are you? Two or three? What number are you? Two. Three. What number are you? Two. Okay, so we're going to change around the group a little bit. So can the number two stand up? Okay, number two, change your group. Go to another group. You're going to be the mediator now, but you're going to be the mediator in a different group. So, to make things a little bit quicker, we don't have to prepare much. The first one we'll do the, media the same mediation as the last time. The second one we'll do the Red Dog Restaurant we did before for negotiation as mediation. Okay? So, uh, I know this classroom, the setup is not very good, but uh, maybe you guys can go down to the back of the room and then you can sit there with the mediator in the middle and the other two people, right? And you guys... You guys can also go down to the back of the room and sit at the back of the room. It's easier, there's chairs at the back of the room. So make like the mediator in the middle and the two people on each side. And then you guys can do here. There's the mediator in the middle. No, number two is the mediator. This time, you will be the mediator the next time. So look, at the back of the room, there's a, there are some loose chairs. I mean, down here, the very back. Okay, so how long do you need to prepare? Does anybody need page, or do you have your page from the last class? Does anybody forget their page? I need me. So just take two minutes to prepare, okay? So we, we actually have a different role than the last time. You were Barbara the last time, you're Christina this time, okay? And we have a new mediator. Okay? So change your role and a new mediator and just get ready your opening speech. Prepare your opening statement. And the mediator just get ready. Which questions are you going to ask? How are you going to do the mediation? We're already familiar with the information, so it should just take two minutes. Last time, Christine. So you're Albert this time, and you're Christine. So who were you the last time? You were mediator. Who were you? So you're Albert. And you're Christine. Okay. You want to be Albert, and you're going to be Christine again. Okay. So you 
you guys are lucky you're near the camera, <laughs> so you can watch your mediation later <laughs> on YouTube. <laughs> yes, you can see how you did in your mediation. We'll have 10 minutes for the mediation after we start. So, I'll write here the time on the board. <coughs> so, we have the opening statements. Okay, that's one, one minute each. So here is the structure. We have mediator welcomes, then there's the opening statements. Then the mediator summarizes the two people's point and thanks them for the information. On the page you have a sentence that the mediator can say. Okay, here. Then the private interview, two minutes each, and then the mediator check you understand the two people and propose a solution. Do you have any questions? About the structure, the time structure? No. no. So there's some vocabulary written on the sheet, for example, at the end, right? The mediator can say, Thank you for sharing your stories and sharing your concerns. Okay, that kind of thing. Okay, so then, whenever you're ready, you can begin. Okay, so then let's begin. So the mediator needs to welcome the people, thank them for coming. Thank you. 
this product is giving the family family member to in the blood. Albert's wife is family, but she is not not blood blood blood. She is not blood. So I think the earring is the uh, our tree. So is Tessen the family blood. If Albert and his wife divorced, so she I also have a lot to get a journey because I'm uh, I'm a I'm an executor of the family. Also, my wife has a right to sharing my asset. And Christian live a unstable lifestyle, so I think that she cannot maintain our legacy. I can't trust them because she always can divorce with her partner because they didn't live a marriage life. <coughs> Also, jury is given to me by my father's will. Privately. 
Right, so I'll start asking you some questions then. Did you make a proposal? Could you 
in 15. So we have to try and persuade her or change her proposal a little bit. <laughs> Maybe you can ask her what she wants, right? What would she be happy with? She's refusing. Right? Ask her what would she be happy with? You can try some reality testing too, right? So it's like she doesn't want to.
some solution to any false fail mediation, but give some feedback to the mediator. So give some thing they can improve and something you think they did well. Did you guys get a solution here? Yes. What's your solution? Albert, uh, take uh, all of uh, mother's legacy except the uh, earring because earring is memory item to Christine and she only care about the earring so so you made you invented some parts that the earring is very important yeah lifestyle all right so he changed his idea so you think you did a good job <laughs> very good job <laughs> so tell her something she can improve and something she did well yeah. stand up and change your group. So try to be in the group where with people you weren't with before. So change your group to somebody group that people you weren't with before. Well you weren't with them so you can go here. Mediator, so you can change your seats if you need to. You're the mediator. For the negotiation, so you should be somewhat familiar with the facts. We have a tenant and the landlord. Okay. Uh, this time we have a mediator in the middle who's going to try and help. Okay. So the everything was fine. They agreed to the lease, but then the Red Dog franchise went bankrupt. Okay. So the tenant has to decide: Are they going to still open the restaurant or not? but they cannot afford to pay the high rent. Okay? So they have to try mediator can try and find an agreement where they find the appropriate price for the rent. Okay? We have some reality testing here. If we can't make a deal, it's very bad for the landlord. They have to accept a much lower rent, right? If we if we can't make a deal, it's very bad for the tenant. Okay, they lose their equipment and so on. Okay? So just take a couple of minutes to prepare your opening statement. And the mediator, you need to write make some questions you're going to ask. This time you guys can watch yourself on camera later.
take one more minute to prepare. You can ask me if you have any question. The landlord and tenant, you have to understand so you can prepare your opening statements. Mediator, you need to prepare some questions. You can look at the other page if you need help to make some questions that you're going to ask the both sides. Okay. Do you have your the other page, the mediator? You can also ask, do you have the other page? The other page? You don't have? Can you give it to her? No, the other page. Yes, on the other mediator. The first one. Uh, so you can look at these questions, right? Maybe some of those questions can help you. Might be able to answer similar questions. Okay then, so then let's begin. So we have 10 minutes to do the negotiation. Okay. The landlord wants high rent, the tenant wants cheap rent. Okay. So let's begin. So the same structure, mediator welcome, opening statements, one minute, mediator summarize and thank, private interview, two minutes So you can summarize what she said, okay? So thank you. You would like the rent to be $700 a month at 0.5% gross, right? And then ask them. So what's your opening statement? Right? Can't solve the negotiation. 